Ladies and gentlemen, esteemed colleagues and friends, we are here today to address a critical issue that affects not just the individuals caught in its grip, but our society as a whole, homelessness. Think about the last time you walked past someone living on the street. Did you avert your gaze or did you see a fellow human being in need? It's time for us to face this crisis head on and redefine our approach to homelessness. I introduce to you today, the Comprehensive Integration System. The CIS, ladies and gentlemen, is not just a program, it's a promise, a promise that every member of our society deserves a chance to live a dignified life. A life that's not defined by the struggle for basic human needs, but by fulfillment, purpose, and contribution to the community. This holistic system is anchored in five pillars, mental health, physical health, life skills, housing, and job skills as well as job placement. By focusing on these areas, we're not just addressing the symptoms of homelessness but working to dismantle the systemic barriers that perpetuate it. Imagine, if you will, a system that offers comprehensive mental health services to those battling the emotional and psychological toll of homelessness. Assessments, treatments, support groups, and continued care become a lifeline to those struggling with mental health issues. They are not left to suffer in silence. Instead, they're given the tools to heal and build resilience. Doesn't every human deserve that? Imagine a system that prioritizes physical health. Regular checkups, health education, and assistance with health insurance ensure that the physical toll of living on the streets is addressed. We often take our health for granted, but for these individuals, this care can be the difference between life and death. Through life skills training, we can equip our fellow citizens with the tools to navigate daily tasks. Basic skills like personal hygiene, cooking, and budgeting can often be the bridge between life on the streets and successful independent living. Now picture the doors of opportunity opening with access to adequate housing. Temporary housing leads to permanent solutions, providing the stability required to truly turn a life around. Ask yourselves, can any of us truly thrive without a place we can call home? Finally, visualize a system that empowers individuals with job skills and placement services. Through assessment, training, and employment support, we are not just providing a job, we're offering a lifeline, a purpose, a chance to contribute, and a reason to hope. Wouldn't our workforce be richer for their inclusion? Ladies and gentlemen, the beauty of the CIS is in its graduated approach. It understands that each individual is on their own unique journey. From intensive support in the early stages, to transition assistance, to eventual integration and continued post-integration support, the CIS is there every step of the way. It respects each person's individual pace and empowers them to reclaim their lives. Isn't this a kind of compassionate, human-centric approach we can all stand behind? Funding, as you may wonder, can be sourced from various channels, including government funding, nonprofit grants, corporate social responsibility initiatives, and public donations. Not only is this system humane, but it's also cost effective. Healthcare savings, reduce dependency on social services, decrease criminal justice expenditure, and increased economic productivity. These are the economic benefits our society stands to gain from this program. I urge you to consider the bigger picture. The homeless individuals we see on our streets are not just statistics, they are people. They are our neighbors, our potential colleagues, and our fellow citizens. We are presented with an opportunity to transform lives and, in doing so, transform our communities. Our collective will and commitment can power the CIS. It's time for us to step up and act. We owe it to our fellow citizens and to ourselves to foster a society where everyone can live with dignity, contribute positively, and lead a fulfilling life. The comprehensive integration system is our chance to make a meaningful difference. Ladies and gentlemen, every step we take to support the homeless is a step towards a more inclusive, compassionate, and prosperous society. Consider this, if you were in their shoes, wouldn't you want someone to extend their hand and say, I believe in you. Let's help you get back on your feet. That's what the CIS is all about. It's more than a program. It's our shared commitment to uplift those among us who have fallen on hard times. As we leave here today, I want you to remember this. Homelessness is not a problem that's too big to solve. It requires thoughtful, comprehensive solutions and the courage to implement them. The CIS is our opportunity to write a new narrative on homelessness, one of hope, resilience, and shared prosperity. The question is, are we ready to stand up and embrace this change? Are we ready to change the way we see and respond to homelessness? Our actions today will define our society's future. Let's ensure that future is one of compassion, inclusivity, and shared success. Thank you, and let us commit to creating a society where everyone has a place to call home. Please subscribe to the channel and share this video.